Hey guys, it's Huff. I am back again and this is going to be my update for my peeping pan project pan which I am doing in collaboration with a whole bunch of other people at the Pantastic Ladies. They'll all be linked down below. This has not been very successful, I have to say. Um, the whole premise of this project is for you to get usage out of things and hit pan on them so when you want to put them in a project later on it's not quite so daunting because you already have pan. <laughs> that's the idea behind it. Um, I have four products in here and uh, yeah, not, not, <laughs> not doing so great, I have to say. So um, one of them is champagne from the Laroque Pro palette, which is like right here. This didn't get touched at all. I actually forgot that I had it in a project. I have other shadows that are in here that are in projects um, and none of them got used either. It's sitting in the drawer that I have the stuff that's in projects in, but for some reason I just don't even bother pulling it out, which is really stupid. Um, we have the SOS eyeshadow from NYX, the single shadow. I've used this a few times, but it literally, like, there is no evidence whatsoever that I've touched this thing. It's like barely a wear mark in it, even though I know I've used it. And the blush from OXX, which I've used lots of times. Like, more times than I used Well Dressed from MAC this month. And it also looks completely untouched. Like, I never even went anywhere near it. That's like <laughs> no evidence whatsoever. But I did use it a lot. The only thing that looks like it's changed at all and might almost be, almost have pan in it, is the contour shade from the BYS Contour Trio in Sweet. Now that little dot there is sort of pan. Uh, what I did is I stuck a pin in it because I wanted to see how thick it was because there's quite a big dent in that part and sort of the edges <laughs> of that are moving. Uh, and yeah, so it's got a little bit bigger, so I guess I've sort of hit pan, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep on using this one for April and see how much bigger I can make that little tiny dot get in before I um, say that I've actually hit pan on it. So I want to see more pan than you can currently see. So yeah, that is the only one that is getting anywhere. It has a really large, really, I don't you probably can't even tell camera. Um, it actually has a really large dent through here. Uh, yeah, so we'll see how that one goes. That one will probably be able to be swapped out at the end of April. But uh, yeah, not my most successful of my projects this month. So that is it for my peeping pan update. If you want to subscribe, click the button down there. Leave me a thumbs up if you like Project Pan type videos. And leave me a comment down below. I try to respond to all comments. And I'll see you in my next video. See ya.